Hi, welcome to Math Test Prep, where we are going to answer a standardized math test question where we use data to make an inference. A school cafeteria manager conducted a survey to determine the student's favorite hot lunch. Five different random samples of 100 students each completed the survey. The results are shown in this table. There are 2,000 students in the school. Based on the survey results, which of the following is closest to the expected number of students whose favorite hot lunch is grilled cheese? So the first thing we're going to do is identify that there are 2,000 students in the school, and we are making a prediction based on how many of the 2,000 are going to like grilled cheese. So we want to know X number out of the 2,000 in the school. The next we need to understand that we are doing the expected number of grilled cheese. So we are making a prediction or an inference. We know that five random samples of 100 students, so we know that 500 students were surveyed, and out of the 500 students surveyed, this many of the 500 picked grilled cheese. So if I add up all these values, I'm going to get 219, and it was out of 500 students that were surveyed. So now I can use this and predict. So I'm going to solve the proportion using cross product property. So 500 times x will equal 2000 times 219. So there's my equation. 500x equals 2000 times 219. We are going to multiply 2000 times 219 and divide both sides by 500 to get 876, which means my prediction would be closest to C. 900 students out of 2000 would like grilled cheese. That's how you use data to make an inference.